Somehow technology allows you to do a lot of things, but you have to do them linearly, one after the other. We use apps, websites, databases, friends, parents, phone calls, Facebook groups. I thought, how about taking this to the next level, which is information search? And I thought there's a growing value for technology that brings everything together. Welcome to London. Kiana is a company that's uh, trying to bring AI and big data to the consumers um, in a very affordable way. The kind of data that we use would be downstream space. We use a lot of data from social media because that's where we get the sentiments, the emotions, the online trend. It integrates everything into a combined perception of the world and as we feed more and more data into it, it makes better sense of the world. It's a completely new way to visualize and sense and understand and know a city. So I have had a very linear career, you know, started with engineering in India, ended up with being an entrepreneur in England, so linear. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, quite a few milestones. Um, I think the first one was me being born, that goes back a really long time. <laughs> It doesn't matter how many books you read and how many people you talk to, you can't learn swimming by correspondence. But the biggest thing that no one really, really tells you is that it's emotionally and psychologically a complete roller coaster. Like, it completely challenges your self confidence and your emotional quotient like crazy. Um, because remember, it's not just you, you're taking a lot of people on this journey with you, and they have risked a lot to come along with you. The idea was big, I guess that's what I. That's what, that's what caught me. <laughs> she is the one that brought us together, keeps us together. Um, whenever we have roadblocks, um, we get to call upon her. <laughs> My advice would be um, it's unsolicited advice, um, something no entrepreneur should take. I guess I keep telling them. But if they were to take, I'd say you wouldn't be the best thing since sliced bread ever. There's obviously someone better than you, was better, will be better. That's not the point. You don't have to be the best. You just have to get through today. <laughs> Breathe. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, you won't be feeling this way and life will get back to normal. We have aimed to do something very ambitious. We are trying to bring a product from hardware to software to marketing to sales. We're doing everything with just 15 people and we've successfully managed to do it. And now we want to scale up in the same fashion.